Hello everyone, this is Hitman and you are watching Adobe Illustrator tutorial. This time I'm gonna show you how to draw a web divider. Something like this. Like this one. Uh, basically uh, you need just two effects, gradient fill and opacity. Take a look how I do it. Go to file new and uh, choose uh, web profile. It's, uh, it's in RGB, you can increase in 150 points per inch. Click OK. You'll need a darkish gray background. You don't need outline, and uh, you choose something like this. This color. Okay. How it's done? Basically, I already said that uh, you need just two effects. First, you draw a thin rectangle like this one, and you you put it on the middle like this. And then you add gradient and opacity. It's the only thing you'll need to create a web divider. You choose gradient tool, click on it, you choose radial gradient. And if uh, you'll need uh, to have a dark, uh, something like black color in the middle and the grayish on the ends. If it's like this, uh, you, uh, you just click right here, reverse gradient and you get dark color in the middle. You can choose black and you can always change after. Okay, the other color. It's, it needs to be uh, in the same color as the background. And you choose, click here, double click, and you choose here. Okay, this is not the color we'll need. And then, what we do, we can choose we can choose uh, opacity here. Uh, now it's 100% and you uh, click on it and you can change uh, by 40%. Okay, this is the first step. The other step is the another element like like this one, just a little bit different color. Just uh, hold Alt, click on it, slide down here, and you'll get copied object. Now uh, you'll need to change the color. Right here, it needs to be lighter gray. And right here, maybe like this shade. And the opacity can be 20%. Okay, if it looks like this, uh, you can always uh, change the opacity on the ends. Click on it, click right here, and choose 0%, and you'll get web divider like this. Simply, it's it's simple to get this one, and you can always uh, play with the colors, opacity, and you can add this element right there to look like it's cut out from the inside. So this is how you do how you draw a web divider in Adobe Illustrator. I hope you liked it and see you later. Bye.